next four lines the four stanza tonight will be a stormy night you to the town must go and take a lantern child to light your mother through the snow these lines say the co- these lines quotes here in c- indicate that the speaker is now telling a story now the speaker is is trying to reveal the identity little bit this perhaps a story he has heard from another he is narrating the story which he had heard from somebody else he begins to talk from another point point of view theek hai the person apparently sent the child out in the snow with a lantern to find her mother so this speaker is saying of the poem is saying that the child is out and see she is having a lantern in her hand and she is searching her mother next line that father will i gladly do this scarcely afternoon the minster clock has just struck two and yonder in the moon these lines say the speaker has already described lucy as the sweetest thing in the in the lines above we have seen that lucy has been described as a very sweet thing so it does not come as a surprise now that she uh, should respond that father will i gladly do can i will do this this also reveals that speaker with the coat is lucy's father means the speaker who is talking to lucy is his, is is her father mean to say the these lines where we are curious to know whether she is alone she is out of the society now we are gradually learning that the speaker is her father father sent her daughter out to uh, send his daughter out at 2 o'clock in the afternoon scarcely mr clock mr mist is 2 pm of 2 pm in the afternoon he asks her to take a lantern to her mother lucy gladly goes and with all happiness she goes out to find her mother 